All right, everybody, welcome back to my only hands. And uh, today we're going to need uh, three stopwatches. Uh, I can only imagine, like, in a couple of years, am I going to have just like hundreds of stopwatches all over the table? <laughs> all right, anyway, the proof that it's not edited is you can come see live shows. All right, that's that's how it works. I'll be in Chicago and LA coming up uh, in a couple of months. All right, so for this particular video, I want to teach something. People are always asking me to teach something. Uh, so for this video, I'll do something very simple, something known as a flourish like this, uh, something just that looks pretty cool. Uh, it's a way to shuffle the cards kind of on the side. So let me show you what I mean. Uh, the first thing you do is just push the ends together like this, uh, but you don't push them all the way. I leave about an inch. I press down on the top of the deck like this, and when I push the deck to the left, you can see that it starts to open up like this. It's very, uh, it's a beautiful slide, as a matter of fact. Uh, so the deck does get shuffled in the process, obviously, but uh, it's not about that. It's about just something that looks cool. Uh, so let me do it again and show you what not to do. This is uh, from teaching it. I noticed that a lot of people have this problem. If you push the cards too close together like this, it just essentially becomes a shuffle. When I squeeze like this, the deck won't open up. If the deck doesn't open up properly, of course, it's not going to do that blossom thing that it does when you push it across the mat. All right. Also, you need the mat for this. You can't do this on a, a hard surface. So let's do it one last time. I'll move all the way over here on this side, push down like this and slowly push. And another really interesting thing about this particular uh, flourish is that if you just push just right like this, you can actually get this thing to balance on its end, which is really cool. I mean, how cool is that? Now, with all my videos, whenever I get to the end, people are like, oh, yeah, but you didn't find the kings or something. So here's the uh, four kings. If that's not impressive, you can also uh, perhaps find the four aces. I mean, that's pretty cool too. But uh, honestly, with this particular flourish, you can find the twos, the threes, the fours. You can find pretty much any four of a kind that uh, that you want for that. So the least I can do is, uh, since I just passed uh, 1 million followers across all my socials, to just give back and teach something just super simple that, that you guys can do uh, for your friends, all right? So there you go. Thank you much. I appreciate it and uh, enjoy.